Here's my official answer for the record. Um, Kiss my ass. I do not apologize. In fact, by all rights, you sick freaks should be the ones apologizing to me. Person today. Goodbye. Bitch, I'm a motherfucking transgender person. Have you heard of Matt Walsh? If not, you should know him as the person who created the What is a Woman documentary. This documentary tries to paint transgender people as mentally ill and tries to deny trans people their genders. Matt Walsh just made an absolute fool out of himself on the Joe Rogan show. Whenever asked how many transgender kids he thinks are on puberty bumpers, he estimated that it was in the millions. But the reality, 4,007. Watch this clip. How many people have had this done? Depends on what. I don't think we have exact numbers, but it's if we're talking about the drugs, it's I mean millions. Um, Do you talk about human, hormone blockers? Yeah, millions of kids have, have been on hormone blockers. Really? Uh, I, I'm sure someone's going to fact check me on that, but my 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 guess is that we're in we're into the millions now at this point. Yeah, that would be my guess. Think that uh, that that this shouldn't this shouldn't be happening to. It's a very small number. That's right. It okay. says over the last five years, there were at least 4,780 adolescents who started puberty blockers and had a prior gender dysphoria diagnosis. This says it's kind of undercounted, but that's... That would be a big undercount. Less than a thousand people a year. You know, hundreds of thousands. At this point. I could be wrong. Million sounds great. Yeah. <laughs> now, this may seem like really silly and stuff, but the truth is Matt Walsh is one of the top lobbyists for anti-transgender legislation in the United States. And so the fact that he's willfully getting these kinds of things wrong just goes to show how far they're willing to distort the facts in order to prevent transgender youth from transitioning. In another video, he advocates for teenage pregnancy and conservatives have the gall to call us groomers. This would sink anybody else but because it's Matt Walsh. Gender-affirming healthcare for all.